mount mark and the uh, front pair has gapped the field by some 10 lengths and they're rolling as they race toward that front quarter nobody hesitating 26 and 4 first heat they were there in 27 1 so a quicker pace than we had in the first heat and not letting up as they enter the back stretch now on the backside tom ridge length and a half racing second is can tab hall tom ridge tries to slow the pace right now and that pair, 12 lengths ahead of Coventry, who's third. Racing four citation, five down the backside, Rocky Balboa. At the back of the field is Skywatch as they approach the half-mile mark. First heat, they were there in 55-1. and one. They are reaching that marker. Tom Ridge heads Cantab Hall in 54-3. and three. An amazing pace in the second heat. They enter the upper turn, and Tom Ridge, the world champion, has the lead. Cantab Hall has had the perfect trip. He is enjoying that journey behind the leader as they head now midway around the upper turn. And Tom Ridge, under no stress, trotting easily, fluently, flowing along as they reach the three-quarter mile mark with Can Tab Hall equally uh, fluent behind him. And now they're past that mark and soon to flush to the outside will be Can Tab Hall. Folks, 122, they're uh, there, two-fifths quicker than the first heat. Top of the lane, we're seeing a world record for two heats, no doubt about it. In the lane, Tom Ridge is powerful. This day does belong to that great three-year-old trotter. Can Tab Hall is trying on the inside and now here he comes, but it's Tom Ridge overpowering today. Tom Ridge to the wire will he do it and he is at the wire in 150 and two fifths 150 and two unbelievable at the Ducoin State Fair we have seen a world record we have seen